And thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Tim Seaman. And I'm Bridget Bennett. Tonight, all eyes are on the Missouri River as it is expected to crest sometime overnight. That's right. Many Sioux Line communities already experiencing flooding and folks are beginning to become exhausted now after a third round of flooding this year. But officials continue to say that even if this local flooding doesn't look to be as severe as some of the past, things still should be taken seriously. It's our top story tonight at 10. Evacuation orders continue for people in Dakota Dunes tonight. Officials warning folks in the community that the rising Missouri could breach levees that city officials say were not designed to handle such frequent rounds of continued flooding. And officials in the dunes are still monitoring conditions, assessing the threat to levees in the area. They check those as often as possible to ensure the safety of the community. But they say they do want folks to know the safest thing to do has been to evacuate. If we do have something catastrophic, if there's a breach or something like that, you know, uh, transportation becomes an issue because low-lying roads flood and that kind of stuff. And we don't want a, a situation to happen in the middle of the night where we have to try to try to get people out of here. So, And Dooley reminds folks that if they do not have business in Dakota Dunes, to please stay out of the area until the flooding situation begins to end.